تعط بس بس عشان تليفون يعني بتشجعه بتشجع اوي بتشجع The idea behind the project was to bring individuals together from around the world of different personalities and skills. It shows riders going out, searching and finding some of the most beautiful places and most epic landscapes and hills to skateboard down. Um, it's a side of other sports that's been showcased a lot, uh, it's a side of longboarding that's never been tapped before. What I felt the trip represented is the progression of of the sport and how we have got to that point where we can do something like that's been happening in surfing and snowboarding, now it's happening in downhill. Everybody on the trip had their own style of riding, their own type of gear they ride, things like that. It was really interesting just skating with that many unique personalities and it really gives you a different feel when you watch, you know, eight skate together. Everybody's doing wacky things. So many crazy people at once for such a long time. Great group of people. Um, Everybody's everybody's their own person. Everybody's really cares about this project a lot. Everybody wants to make it the best. Well, I'm really hoping that this trip is like the start of like a spark of things to come. I think kids will be stoked. Everybody will be stoked. I'm kind of stoked a little bit. <laughs> this project has been a real learning process. I've never done something like this. No one in the industry of longboarding has done something like this. incredible. This is my dream to be able to do this.
This is like completely different because we're in the middle of nowhere. Well, it seems like we're in the middle of nowhere, but I guess we're in the middle of Switzerland. Awesome, I love Swiss people and the way they decide to build a road because instead of having a hairpin go straight into another hairpin, they add five or six cool, interesting little sweepers, maybe a little kink here for pre-drifting and it's, it was pretty cool. We're just so blessed with these roads. It's just a, a gift we have. They design roads differently here. They seem to not mind using as much tar as possible to get up a very steep pass. I can so remember a South African mate we brought up to these hills and he was like nearly burst out in tears after the first run. He's like, Sammy, Sammy, you know, I live on one of the best hills in Cape Town and when I go back there, it'll never be the same again. I'm really stoked to be here and the hill is just in perfect shape. It's funny because sometimes there's cash on the side of the road, but right now it's pristine, it's a beautiful day. And Oh, it's one of my favorite hills in Switzerland. It's awesome. But I realized there's really not that much good coffee in uh, Switzerland. I mean, it's been difficult to get used to how expensive everything is here. Obviously, our, we don't have a strong currency, so the exchange rate has been pretty brutal. So I think it's a pretty uh, unique experience for uh, North Americans to be able to go to a place where uh, the cheese is actually being made and, and sold at. Um, Switzerland was very expensive. Um, and the food is terrible. Uh, and all the Swedish people eat is meat, cheese, and bread. <laughs> the chocolate this is the best thing in Switzerland. Get this time lapse. Yeah. Oops. Trash zone. Is it a, yeah, is it a good day for trash zone? <laughs> good morning. Get up. Welcome to Greener Pastures. It's a lovely day in the neighborhood. It's cloudy. It's, um, it, it, I'm really tired right now. Wake up time. It's James Kelly. What's the name of the other person in the tent? Your mom. Claudia? Your mom. We have one now with the camera. It's part of the deal. <laughs> <laughs> cool, I'm up. Go move on to the next tent. Okay, next tent. G Mac. So let's see what's inside <laughs> this tent. Oh, Nolly! It's Nolly! <laughs> oh, it's <God>. like... <laughs> Look at him! Oh, He's oh. woke up, he's ready! Fuck yeah! Good morning, how are you? Yeah, I'm fine, I'm really surprised! Why are you surprised? You're so serious! I know dude, that's you my skateboard! He's <laughs> team old guy! <laughs> no! Okay! Did you get that? What's the best thing about getting woken up by Yvonne Abba? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's the sneaky one, damn it. I'm scared now. You better be scared. 
Good morning, Ramon. It's time to skateboard. So Ramon felt the need to wake us all up at six in the morning. And uh, we got up, we rested, and now Ramon is catching up on some sleep. I forgot we did that. Come on Ramon, it's time to skateboard. Sleepy time was earlier, now it's skateboard time. <laughs> 